It is a story that made many of you upset. A 75-year-old grandmother arrested and jailed in the middle of the night over a case related to her pets. Her family says it didn't need to go this far, but county officials say she repeatedly broke the rules. 10 News reporter Emerald Morrow explains how the case escalated so far. And a warning, I do want to share with you some of these photos are difficult to look at. It's very unfair. I feel like um, they need to adjust their policies and procedures when it comes to the elderly. When 75 year old Cynthia Latson faced Judge Daryl Manning on Friday, she was in tears. Mrs. Latson is a good woman. She doesn't have any malintent. She's not looking to try and take advantage of any circumstances. She's an older ailing woman who finds solace in helping animals. But animal control officials say some of the animals were hurting. We located animals that were in, in very bad condition. Since at least 2017, Latson has been in dispute with the county's pet resources division over her animals. You had to euthanize and why not just take all of the animals away if some of them well, were in such bad condition? <clears throat> well, we did take, originally we took them all to have them veterinarian assessed. Uh, and during the um, investigation, we agreed to let her have a certain number back through a court order that would uh, require us to go out and do uh, regular inspections to ensure she was taking care of them properly. They agreed to that for a few reasons. Well, based on the fact that the house was in, in a bad shape, um, it was in fairly good condition, uh, the, the living condition, the animals, there was some of them that were in good shape. So we try to keep the number low, something they can take care of. But Animal Control says she did not do that, even though she signed this court order saying she would. She never complied with it. She never let us in the house after several attempts to try to get in, even going back and trying to make phone calls and she wouldn't answer our phone calls. At that point, a judge had to get involved. But when Ladson missed her hearing, a warrant went out for her arrest. We want to try to make sure that they can have, you know, they can have animals to share their lives with. But, you know, you have to cooperate. And Latson's children say that they tried to help their mom and they plan to continue to help her so that this does not happen again.